I don't know if you guys have ever um, seen these videos of these people that like they like go out of their way to like bait police officers they'll like film them like parked in front of something illegally and then they'll go oh what's your name officer blah, blah, blah. and then they'll like like completely harass police officers or they'll be filming on like the city hall property and taking pictures baiting police officers into stopping them so they can have some kind of altercation and film them it's just new and i just want to say before we go any further i'm not republican i'm not democrat i'm nothing okay but this new breed of asshole okay that um you know talks to then the way they talk to the police officers you know what i mean like they'll tell them to shut the fuck up get back in your car this i mean just a total like but they're they're like filming for like the rights of everybody and they have this cause that you know all police you know like nothing makes you look dumber than filming a police officer eating his lunch i'll just tell you that right now you know what i mean this guy's talking to a female police officer making fun of her last name saying da -da -da, this is i don't know if you guys have ever seen these videos but they're so moronic um you're talking to listen you're talking to a woman, dummy. Do you know what I mean? Do you know how stupid you look talking to a woman like that? You're talking to somebody's mom like you're a dude, you know? Um, I don't know what what um you're trying to, like, accomplish. You're bullying somebody. You're bullying somebody. This new breed of asshole, okay? That's what pussies do. They film shit, you know? These people ain't going in somebody's backyard and stealing their pit bull, okay? I can tell you that right now, okay? That's what you do. You film shit. You know, I don't film shit. I do shit in real life. I don't, I don't have time to film it because I'm doing it, you know? It's just, it's just craziness. This girl in line at her store had a shirt that said, I am the mother of a biracial set of children. I need to feel comfortable. I need to feel safe. My children are my life, and without them, I can't breathe. Like saying, talking about that guy that couldn't breathe that got um, choked to death by a police officer. Um, you know, which is, you know, it's like saying all police officers are going to choke you to death. But just the shirt was like, are you really? Are you really that fucking pathetic? Do you know what I mean? Like, you're really that pathetic. You're, you're really, you really need to go. You know what that is? I call that a, a, a safety cushion, you know, because you can just go through your life blaming white people for all your problems. Do you know what I mean? Um, and this is coming from a guy that lost his job at, at a prison for um, sticking up for a black guy. So just before anybody goes in that direction, I just want to let you know, um, you know, people that do this, don't have what it takes to be a police officer. You know what I mean? People that have this, that do this shit, film stuff, they don't have what it takes to run into a building that's on fire. They don't even have what it takes to to um, rescue a kitten out of a tree. You know? But I can guarantee you that they're fucking Democrats. Okay? There's this just this new breed of asshole, complainer, pussy... You know, entitlement, the world isn't fair, and yada, 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 and, you know, I'm Hispanic, and the world's been bad to me. Listen, I'm white, and the world's been a fucking shitty place to me. Do you know what I mean? Like, uh, I didn't grow up in the fucking gated community outside of fucking um, Lutz, Florida. Do you know what I mean? So, um, that's what the world is. You know what I mean? These people look for excuses like why they never did anything with their life, you know? I'm the mother of biracial kids. Well, congratulations. Wow, you opened your legs and made two fucking kids. And now you're such a coward and such a pathetic fucking human. You have to wear a shirt documenting that you're just a fucking weak-ass individual. That's what you're telling me. You know what I mean? That's what your fucking shirt says to me. Hi, I'm weak. You know what I mean? Hi, I'm a weak fucking person and the world is so mean and 
everybody. Do you think anybody gives a fuck about your little kids? Do you know what I mean? Do you think people are like, do you know how small of a, it's like, you know how small of the pop, you know, it's like being racist. Everybody's fucking racist. Do you know what I mean? Like, if you're going to be real, everybody's racist. You know, there are certain things about certain groups of people, you can call them stereotypes, I call them truth types myself, that happen to be true. There's shit about white people that happens to be true. It's called real talk, you know what I mean? Stuff that these people know nothing about, but it's just so, it's just so crazy that people go out of their way to instigate shit with people that are heroes you know, and first responders, you know, these people ain't going to run into no building in 9-11, you know what I mean? These people would just film it, because that's what cowards do, you know? Cowards instigate shit, you know what I mean? If you think that you're some kind of, like, fucking hero, because you filmed you being rude to a police officer, um... You're the sub, you're, you're, you're the substandard model of a human. Do you know what I mean? You're like, you're, you're like the fucking people that they have to help because you're a coward. You know what I mean? So don't call them when you have a problem. Don't call them when someone smashes your camera or your phone on the ground and you start crying. You know what I mean? It's just so, it's just, I don't know. It's like, it's a new thing to do. It's like, we're holding cops accountable. Let me just give you a quick tidbit of, what? Let me give you a quick tidbit of information. Um, I'm sure being a police officer is a fucking demanding, overwhelming, exhaustive job. They're people just like you and just like me. You know what I mean? But they have something that separates them from the average person, heart, okay, and courage, and a lot of shit that you'll never know anything about, you know, and if you think that you attacking them makes, I don't know, it's like, were you, you know, like, were you bullied or something, like, you know, go to the gym or something, lift some weights, do you know what I mean, like, I don't know, and when I hear the people talking, they always, you know, I'm just saying, like, I'm not trying to stereotype them, but they always sound like fucking nerds. Do you know what I mean? You know, they always sound like nerds. Oh, I'm not, I'm allowed to stand on the sidewalk. I'm allowed to stand on the sidewalk. You're, you're infringing on my rights. You know what I mean? I have a right to, and you have a right, you know what, if I was a police officer, I'd tell you, you have a right to shut the fuck up and keep moving, okay? Because I told you to move. That's why you're moving, Okay. It's just, it's just, it's crazy, you know, and this victim shit, because I'm this color or that color, I mean, look at the fucking white trash neighborhood I fucking live in, do you know what I mean, do you think I go, well, I had it rough when I was a kid, my parents got divorced, I wasn't able to go to college, my sister was, and she's doing better financially than I am, it's like, no, you just, just... Just put, just keep your, keep your head and your nose to the fucking grindstone and just work. You know what I mean? Well, there, well, there's a revelation right there. Work. Something that none of these people know anything about because they're too busy filming um, heroes doing their job that, you know, they couldn't do. It's just, it's just this whiny, no testosterone, liberal, crybaby fucking group of people that... I just can't even believe existed and they're Americans, you know what I mean? Like, nothing, that's not even American, you know? Like, wearing a mask and walking around and driving, you're not an American, you know what I mean? You're not even a human, you're a whiny little bitch, do you know what I mean? Anybody, you know? You're wearing a mask, driving around in your car, nothing says, nothing says, I mean, you know what that says. Let's just be, I'm not even going to get into it. Do you know what I mean? You know what that says about somebody. I don't even care if you're 70 years old. You should be fucking smarter than that. I mean, should you not be? 